Today is Friday, March the 13th. Friday the 13th, day two of the coronavirus in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. I work at a grocery store here in Hattiesburg, Mississippi, and I teach guitar and I teach VIP Kid. I got three jobs, I get tired. So, third, Wednesday night, I was working at, I'm a manager at the grocery store, I was working at the grocery store. One of the employees, one of our employees, I saw on the news where the first person in Hattiesburg, Mississippi had contact, or contacted the coronavirus. We closed at nine o'clock, around between 8.30 and 8.45. All these people came in, started buying full buggies of groceries. Um, we didn't have any, any major problems that night. Uh, and it wasn't you know, necessarily a lot of people, but it was a lot more than usual. So as you saw in my first video of day one, people went out and bought, especially Sam's, Walmart, Target, bought all of the toilet paper they could get, which is basically all the toilet paper, water, and sanit hand sanitizer, and a lot of the cleaning materials. sanitizer I understand not still not sure about the toilet paper um, unless they think they're just going to be in the restroom a lot because of the coronavirus now you do have to realize that in the south, south Mississippi people still remember Katrina and so anytime there's a, a storm or the threat of a hurricane people do buy a lot of supplies uh, to give you an example I think it was two years ago a hurricane was projected to come through Mississippi uh, we sold out of all of our water so much actually we made as much money as we make on the day before Thanksgiving I'm in the store where I'm a manager at today was a busy day uh, we did it was a busy day for us I will say we did as much in, uh, in sales as we normally do on a holiday uh, the water was almost wiped off. As you can see, the water was wiped off the shelf. Uh, we do have some Dasani left, a little bit of Ozarka. I'm assuming because maybe the Dasani is a little more expensive. Some paper towels left. For some reason, no one wanted the single rolls. And no toilet paper. This will have to wash our butts. And like I said, we had a very busy day today, especially for our small store. Uh, we did as well. We did better than we do. Last two days, we've done better than we've done on any holiday that we've had that we had last year, or at least three years since I've been here. One of the ironies to me about this entire situation is that we've been cutting hours since before Christmas. But the sales have increased. Along comes the coronavirus. Our sales drastically increase while our hours drastically decrease. 